Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Just a couple of days ago, I uploaded a Kathy Doll Philippines video and I got a lot of comments requesting that I make a tutorial of that makeup look and it just so happened to be my everyday makeup look. So if you want to know how I do my everyday makeup look, then please keep on watching. Think of this as like a get ready with me video as well. I have my phone with me and some earphones and when I get ready for work, when I'm at home, I always listen to music because music relaxes me. Most of the time, I fix my face in the car because I think it saves time. Pero pag meron akong time na mag-chill, mag-relax, nag-ayos ako sa bahay. Right now, this is the playlist I'm listening to. So first, I start with the toner. I play around with the Gino McGray Professional Makeup Spray or the Clio Green Tangerine Moist Mist Toner. I'm fly like a pawn. And I like to make sure that it's really drenched wet. Let my skin absorb that. And then being said, but hindi na makahintay. I just go in with this sponge. This is my current favorite. It's from Miss Bella PH. Now, usually I would use in Loha Cell and Lightning Ampule, but I think I put it in another bag. I'll skip that for now. I'm gonna use a Super BB Cream from Maybelline. This has always been my favorite. I've been using this for years. Sometimes pag um, natatagalan ko na siya ng gamit, medyo nawawala na yung magic niya for me. So I switch from this to a CC cream or to another BB cream from time to time. Major rule ko sa paglalagay ng foundation or any kind of base. You always bring it down to your neck. It looks a little fair, pero mamaya maya mago oxidize din yung sa akin since acidic naman ako. Something I keep on forgetting since I got a pixie cut na may bangs is my forehead. I make sure I moisturize my lips, which is something that I always forget. I'm gonna use Nukes. Nakita ko to sa Watson the other day, and I think this retails for about 600 pesos. This was just given to me. You know me, my Marinade brush, and cover up Look at the difference if you have a brow and you're so so brow. Something you want to remember when you're doing your brows is that they're not parallel. I mean, unless you have, you know, symmetrical yung left and right side ng face. <laughs> Your left and right side ng face mo, then that's great. But if not, try to figure that out. Kasi yung brows ko, alam ko hindi sila pantay. I know this is higher than this one. Ito, ninipisan ko lang, and then ito medyo makapal ng konti. So this is fine now. But when I feel like being extra, I put a little bit of color on the brows because sometimes I feel like I want to match my hair and my eyebrows. I use my Sleek Makeup Ultra Matte na palette. As you can see, pantay na to, tsaka ito eh. My difference talaga when the eyebrow is the same color as your hair. Whatever floats your boat, then you do that. I remember getting a comment the other day na paulit ulit na roy mga products na ginagamit ko. Sorry if you feel that way. There's a reason why it's called a routine. Probably yung mga pre makeup ko na products na ginagamit. Sorry, I just like using those products, and that is how I really prepare and, and do my makeup. When I feel like I want to have like this ombre thing going on, I just go in with my sponge. So my current favorite is the Colorette Cheek Stain. This is in the color Talia. Let's get a little bit of that. Now, yung gusto ko sa kanya is that you can easily blend it because it has argan oil. I bring that over my nose. You know that. Sit, sit, sit. Good girl. Ojang <laughs> kalang. 
Even si Mishka gusto yung color at Natalia. I put a little bit on my lips. This brush is from the Social Misfit Cosmetics. The powder I'm gonna use is Gina McGray Color Control Powder. It's in only on the areas that get oily. I'm gonna lightly contour. My favorite contour kit is the Anastasia Beverly Hills kit. Social Misfit Cosmetics Olive na angle brush. I like to use this color and sometimes I add this na dito lang para may konting color. That was around the face. I like to mix these two. And then I bring that down a little bit. But I'm a blend now, man. Tapos, I'm gonna put a little bit of color. Itong orange, medyo warm. Na shadow. But only here. And then last, na contour, syempre, sa You've been feeling me not telepathy in your race, telepathy in your cough. Every time I inhale, my chest feel like it's falling off. Give it up. But I'm parang slip yung nose, hindi siya masyadong malapas. And then here is the side. And then I'll just blend that with the same angle brush. And then I go back to my brows. Uh, I use the Jordana Fabio Brow Shape and Set Gel. My eyebrows tend to get unruly, like yung strands ng buho kung saan sa pumupunta. So I like to use this. On my lips, I'm gonna use Ofra. It actually comes with a lip liner. Any nude shade will do, as in any nude shade. I just like this because it's the one I've been using lately. So important na meron siya medyo reddish or pinkish na base. I love it. So while that is moisturized, I'm gonna put a little bit of Loha Cell na lip tint. Mishka! <laughs> Loha Cell Lip Stamp Urban Burgundy Glossy Lip Stamp. Suma? Suma din? I'm not gonna put this color all over the lips, the inner lips lang. Inner corner, sorry. Chaco siya ibiblin. Tapos, for more depth, add a little bit of color in, in the middle. As you notice, lagging may pula pula yung ganyan ko. Kasi tinatanggal ko yung excess lagi from my lips, like this. See? Para wala sa ngipin. You know, when I feel like being extra, I put mascara, usually using Fashion 21 to double up. But since I have no eyelash curler today, I thought I might as well just keep the eyes simple. Cool on my own. No motherfucker gonna ruin my day. I'm fly like a pawn. She don't ever write, but I dream of often. And this is it for my updated everyday makeup routine. I hope you loved it. You don't have to use the same products that I use today. As long as you have shade or consistency, then I'm sure it will work for you. And thank you so much for watching. Stay weird.